The week between Christmas and New Year's is make or break for local ski resorts. We got a full week with no school, which means families can get out there and go skiing. That's right. But when it's what 54 degrees outside as it was earlier today, folks are not thinking about breaking out the snowmobiles or taking a few runs down the hill. Coco McAvoy is live on Mount Brighton tonight, one of the most popular local ski spots. And uh, what's it like there, Coco? Good afternoon. Check it out. The parking lot at Mount Brighton is full. And although it's been sunny and beautiful all day long, the people here have been playing in the snow. Now come with me and walk with me this way. You can see all the snowboards are set up here at Mount Brighton. And as we're walking through Mount Brighton, it's honestly like we're entering a whole nother world. You can't see snow in many places here in Metro Detroit, but here at Mount Brighton, you can see there's a ton of snow and people are really enjoying it, playing in it here on the slopes and the people who run this place tell me that no matter what it's like outside they're gonna have snow on the ground here it's a picturesque day at Mount Brighton the Sun is shining and the spirits are high <laughs> it's one of the only places where you'll find piles of snow on such a warm December day so great to get some fresh air and after the holidays be out here enjoying the snow. But warm temperatures aren't normally ideal for ski resorts. We definitely like to see it a little colder out here uh, and certainly for us to be able to fire up the snow making guns again. General Manager Beth Lohman says closing isn't an option, so they're making it work by maintaining the snow they already had. You know, we did get rain last night, but our groomers were out bright and early this morning, getting the getting the hell put back together. Up north, it's a different story. Lost Pines Lodge depends on snowmobilers, and this year, the lack of snow is detrimental to the business. We're ready to go. We're ready for the snow in the winter. Our people are excited to come up, and it's just it is a big letdown. The temps will fall again tomorrow and perhaps it'll stay that way. But even if it doesn't, you know, we know how to roll with the punches to make the most of our unpredictable Michigan winters. And it is really beautiful out here, but we should add that we did call around to several other ski resorts in Metro Detroit, and many of them were closed because of the warm temperatures. So this is having an impact on business. Back to you. Yeah, no doubt. All right, Coco. It is nice when it's a little warmer on the hill, you know? You I think don't have it to is a little bundle bit. up. You don't have to, yeah, take those breaks, go in and get warm. You can just practice. Get your it. hot chocolate. <laughs> or a cold beverage <laughs> when you get in the <laughs> It's not the lack of snow. It's not just anecdotal. It bears out in the statistics. There has only been one year in Detroit history that we've had less snow than we have this year. And that really? was 1889. Wow. They were keeping records back then. But yeah, they did. They chiseled it into a stone tablet and, <laughs> and, we, and we still have it. Uh, zero. They got that year. 